Welcome viewers, in this video we will see the race around condition available in the flip flop. Subscribe the channel for more videos and notifications. Soft copy of this material available in the drive. The link is given in the description box. Now we will go to the topic race around condition in the flip flop. We know that flip flop is the storage element. It can able to store one bit data. The output is depends upon the earlierly available output as well as input. The input and present state of output will decide the next state of output. That is the basic, the basic of the flip flop. So in this, what is the race around condition? It is the phenomenon which occurs in level triggering JK flip flops when there is a one at both the input of input terminals. For example, in JK flip flop, the J value as well as K value is one. Both are one. In that case, the race around condition is exist. What is that race around condition? Race around means continuous toggling. The output will toggle from 0 to 1, 1 to 0. It is continuously toggle. Why it is toggling? If the width of clock pulse is too long, because in the we know that flip flop, every clock pulse the status will changes. It is a sequential circuit. When the clock pulse applies, the state will change from one state to another state. So in this, the width of the clock pulse is too long compared to the propagation delay of the gate. The state of flip-flop will keep on changing. That is from 0 to 1, 1 to 0, 0 to 1 and so on. And at the end of the clock pulse, its state will be uncertain. We don't know what is the output. right? So the clock pulse is too long but propagation delay of the gate is lesser. So the state is changes from 0 to 1 but still after changing also the clock pulse is there means it will keep on changing 0 to 1, 1 to 0. right? So that we need to maintain clock pulse is less than the propagation delay of the gate. That is the one thing. Another thing is we can go for master slave flip flop. That is two flip flops are connected in series. So that is the remedy for this race around condition. So the clock pulse is more, propagation delay is less, the race around condition exists that is 0 to 1, 1 to 0 changes. So the clock pulse duration less than or equal to propagation delay of the NAND gate. So that is TP clock pulse should be less than DT that is the propagation delay of the NAND gate. So this is possible in edge triggered flip flop. Edge trigger means during positive edge or negative edge that is from 0 to 1 when the clock pulse changes from 0 to 1 is a positive edge triggering. 1 to 0 is a negative edge triggering that is one possibility. Another possibility is master slave flip flop. right? So these two cases available by using master slave or edge triggered we can avoid this race around condition. So in this video we discuss race around condition in the flip flop. Now we will see the master slave JK flip flop. The diagram shows the master slave JK flip flop. Positive clock pulse applied to the first flip flop that is called master and inverted clock pulse is applied to the second flip flop that is called slave. Now we will see the diagram logic diagram of the master slave JK flip flop. So this is the flip flop one. Four NAND gates are available. This is another flip flop. Another four NAND gates are available. This is slave. This one is master. Both are connected in series. Clock pulse given to the first, first flip flop master. Then that same clock pulse is connected through the NOT gate is given to so the inverted clock pulse is given to the second flip flop slave so so it is nothing but positive edge is triggered by the first flip flop because of inverted negative edge triggered by the slave flip flop second flip flop then here the preset is available we can preset similarly here clear clear is available so the main objective of this master slave flip flop is the race around condition can be eliminated if both 
inputs are one j is one and k is also one mean the toggling will occur continuously that can be avoided by connecting two flip flop in series with inverted clock pulse now we'll see the description one by one when clock pulse equal to one the first flip flop is enabled and the output of qm and qm bar respond to the input of j and k according to the table so the clock pulse is one mean only the first flip flop will be enabled because second flip flop getting inverted so the clock pulse becomes zero for second flip flop only first flip flop is enabled so based on the truth table the uh, value of j and k the output present state and inverted present state will be available at this time the second flip flop is inhibited because of its clock pulse is zero ck is zero now we'll see the truth table what is the truth table of the jk flip flop when the clock pulse is applied to the first flip flop what will happen so this is the two inputs j and k this is present state and this is next state qn is present state qn plus one next state we know that flip flop is a storage element it will store one bit data the output is depends upon input as well as earlierly available output so this output next state is depends upon what is the present state output as well as the input j and k so q n plus 1 depends upon j k to inputs and previously available output q n now we'll see the combination if both are zero if both are j zero and k zero means what is the present state same thing will be reflected zero means zero one means one if both are zero present state and next state is same there is no change so that is also given here j k q n plus one j also zero q also zero mean q n plus one is nothing but q n next state is previous state right next one zero one j is zero k is one Actually, it is SR, reset. Reset means, reset input is 1. Reset means what is it? Reset means 0. If the input, previous state is 0, means next state also 0. If previous state is 1, means next state is 0. It is reset. The output become 0. Whatever may be, if it is 0 or 1, the output become 0. The next state become 0. For the case, 0, 1, 0, 1. 0 means 0, 1 means also 0. Then 1, 0. 1, 0 means J input is 1. That is set. It will set the output. Set means 1. 0 means 1. 1 means 1. Whatever may be the input, the output is 1. It will set. That is given here. 0, 1 means the output will be 0. 1, 0 means the output will be 1. Next state will be 1. Suppose if it is 1, 1. Both are 1, 1. Means toggle. 0 means present previous state is 0 means next state will be 1. Previous state is 1 means next state will be 0. That is Q n bar. So this is the truth table of the flip flop. Both inputs are 0 means there is no change in the next state. Both are same. Q n plus 1 equal to Q n. 0 1 means the, out, the next state is 0. Reset. 1 0 means the next state is 1, set. 1, 1 means toggle, q, n, bar. Now we will see the remaining description. When clock pulse goes low, ch bar equal to 1, the first flip flop is inhibited and second flip flop is enabled. At this time, the output of second flip flop follows the output q, m and q, n bar respectively. That is the, if uh, CH, the clock pulse is low mean, first flip flop is disabled, second flip flop is enabled, output from first flip flop is applied to the second flip flop. Second flip flop got the input from first flip flop, that is given. Since the second flip flop follow the first one, it is referred to as the slave and the first is referred as master, right? So the second one is termed as slave, first one is termed as master, right. In master slave JK flip flop, state changes occurs when 
flip flop goes through both positive transition first half of the clock and negative transition of the clock second half right so during positive positive transition the first flip flop will work during negative transition second flip flop work thus race around condition does not exist in the master slave flip flop so the race around condition mean both the inputs are one that is not possible here because of master slave master got positive edge slave got negative edge so the race around condition is eliminated in the jk flip flop master slave jk flip flop so in this video we discuss about what is the race around condition in the flip flop how to avoid one method is master slave and we discuss about master slave jk flip flop master and slave two flip flop connected in series master is the first flip flop got the positive edge clock pulse second flip flop slave got inverted clock pulse negative edge clock pulse then we discuss the truth table of the jk flip flop and we discuss how to avoid the race around condition subscribe the channel for more videos and notification soft copy of this material available in the drive the link is given in the description box thank you for listening